This ain't no motherfucker with $80,000 to put in no motherfucking car. This motherfucker right here, Yeah. he want a good job, but he ain't got all that goddamn money. Uh -huh. Motherfuckers be fed and shit really don't cost a whole lot of money. Overhead would cost money. Mm -hmm. That's what they be charging you yeah, for. The building, the building to pimp you. If you know motherfuckers that do shit like this, mm -hmm. and you right with them, mm -hmm. you know motherfuckers that will say, hey, man, I could do you some shit like this right here. For like, this motherfucker say he want 30, 15,000 for this motor, and I'm going to the machine shop, and he telling me it costs him 25 to do the damn block, the pistons, and the crank. Where that other ten thousand dollars come from? The fucking heads, you can get them all day long. Whole motor, you might have five grand in it. Mm -hmm. And then you turn around and you're trying to sell the motherfucker for fifteen thousand? Where the extra come in at? <laughs> I feel like getting fucked with an out of condom. I'm talking about this motherfucker running a square tube up your ass. Shit! <laughs> you, need, you need a real nigga to work on your shit. Somebody that still love doing this shit. That's all I'm saying. What is motor? You need somebody still love doing this shit. So what is motor going in, Tank? And then motherfucker, huh? What is motor going in? What's his fault? Motor going in this motherfucker right here. This is a uh, 60 what? 69 Cutlass? This is 68. 68. Yes, yeah, convertible. Oh, okay, okay. Straight up, frame on. Mm -hmm. Straight up, frame on money. So what that what that motor what that motor will be putting out, Tank? Put whole brand new flow pan in the motherfucker, pull uh -huh. all the interior out. Go put everything new in that bitch right there in the box, every nut boat. And then you got a motherfucker like uh 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 what that motherfucker name? D Rock? Uh -huh. With the silver and red Chevelle. I heard about that car. Talking about I stole his goddamn color scheme. And his car was just got did, and I did that motherfucker seven years ago. Nigga, I ain't stole nothing from you. If anything, you saw the motherfucker drug through Palo Alto, and you, I don't give a fuck. Take my idea and make it better. That's what it's about. Mm -hmm. But when you tell me you spent 10,000 motherfucking dollars in a rear suspension and show a nigga like me that no cars, your suspension and your exhaust system on a motherfucking video, and I see that motherfucking two-inch shit choking the fuck out of a 502, I wish like hell you would run up on the side of me. <laughs> I would give a damn. Run up on the side of me. I put my birth certificate up on anything I put together mm -hmm. and race the motherfucker for it. Let brain slavery back. I ain't tripping. <laughs> I like to own a couple of niggas like you. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like them type niggas. Yeah, yeah. That thing. Oh, yeah. Money cannot buy everything. What money can do is make a motherfucker charge the fuck out of you. When they see your dumb ass come in. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, fuck that. I, I got money. What it gonna cost me? Yeah, choke your drawers up, nigga, because you finna get fucked. You might as well be wearing a thong. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. This shit right here. Mm -hmm. You know, motherfucker, oh, oh man, that's fucking $100,000. Is that what you want to believe? It's your motherfucking movie. Mm -hmm. You edited it and wrote it the way you want to. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. I be seeing motherfucking shit like that 406 I built back there covered up. Mm -hmm. In the book, man, for 25000 for the motor. But I know motherfuckers with real machine shops, real fucking transmission shops, that give a real nigga like me some love. Because I'm not trying to be that nigga like, well, you know, the molecular structure of the thing really got to happen like this, Steve. And I would appreciate it if you could really, you know, take time out of your busy day to help me. No, I ain't that nigga. Hey, man, you want to do this shit for me? I do some shit for you, and we can do some shit for each other. I know some shit, you know some shit. Let's put this shit together and make it happen. That's what I do. All right, right. Shit, I still love doing this shit. This motherfucker right here. Mm -hmm. When I bring this motherfucker right here back out of money, 
This motherfucker right here, I jumped on a dude on a 1966 fake GTO, but he don't know I know it was a fake GTO. Because, mm. see, I remember when the motherfuckers was new. <laughs> he had a goddamn Tempest Le Mans. The fucking GTO in 66 did never come no goddamn post. Mm -hmm. Le Mans and Tempest. Before I did the motor right here, yeah, that's right. I'm moving shit, cause this a real motherfucking do shit shop. God damn it. Now before I did this motor right here, this right here, this a point. Mm -hmm. This a point right here. A what? A Pontiac. Pontiac. A Pontiac. Uh -huh. Not a Pontiac, but a Pontiac. Pontiac. Yeah, you know how when motherfucker Jason had that axe and <laughs> throwed it in the point, cut that motherfucker. This a Pontiac right here. Oh, okay. I cut that motherfucker with this Le Mans right here. Mm -hmm. And he had an LS6 in his motherfucking shit, fuel injected, talking shit. I nailed his ass with this. Mm. And I hadn't even did it yet. Okay. You know what I told him? What? I said, anytime, anywhere, <laughs> I will race you for my birth certificate. This was a white dude, too. I said, you can own me. You can't own me. Motherfucker, you can own me. Uh, if you outrun me. Mm. All that day. He on that shot down the street. His yeah. shit was on the dyno. He was tuning. <laughs> His shit wasn't running right after that. <laughs> after that little encounter with this motherfucker. Uh, His shit wasn't running right. His shit wasn't running right. His shit wasn't running right. <laughs> Let me see. See that fold right there? Yeah, yeah. Man. This gold one right here? Right here. Oh, right here? Right here. Uh -huh. That that boy right there. What his name? With the Oldsmobile I'm doing, that hit 455. Mm -hmm. I'm doing him some real special shit. Mm -hmm. That nigga get some love, man. Mm -hmm. For real money, he get love on the strength of you. Oh, okay. Oh, Tier, yeah, my boy Tier, yeah, yeah. That's his name. Yeah. I don't even remember his fucking name. He a nice guy, though. Mm -hmm. He a nice guy. He get some real love. I'm talking about shit. Nigga work on goddamn saws too. Nigga work. Shh. That's concrete cutter, right? Cut some fucking concrete and ass out. Mm -hmm. Just in case if this shit ain't moving. Uh -huh. A nigga gotta keep some money moving. <laughs> shit. Motherfucker be standing out there on the corner selling ass and shit. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? Motherfucker, I gotta keep the lights on. What the fuck you think? You need to keep moving. You messing my hustle up. <laughs> <laughs> ah, shit. This right here? Mm hmm. Okay. It's got a huge bracket. Mm -hmm. Like, street and not street and strip, mm -hmm. but bracket. Bracket called transmission in it. Mm -hmm. With a 3500 style. Mm -hmm. I got the real good airflow researches on him. Mm -hmm. The rotating assembly. Man, my dick just getting hard talking about it. <laughs> I ain't lying, I just want to goddamn just fuck one of the exhaust ports right now. Cause this motherfucker right here give you real love. Uh -huh. Money. You see that shit right there? Yeah, yeah. When you take that motherfucker up to 7500 and mm -hmm. shift it, these motherfuckers right here keep all this shit right here from moving. Mm -hmm. Don't none of that shit move. It ain't like you go around and run this bitch turn some donuts or whatever the fuck you want to do, and then the valves and lifters be going clack, 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 clack. Ain't none of that shit going on. None of that. But this boy, right here. Mm -hmm. What kind of carburetor is that? This motherfucker, this is a certified uh -huh. 750 CFMs for real. Uh -huh. For real, CFMs, sit on the motherfucking white folk, put it on the fucking machine. And run it. And put that sun. 
Put that suction to that motherfucker. Make sure that bitch right now flowing. 750 CFMs. Mm -hmm. Whatever the fuck that mean. Fuck the CFMs. I want to know if this is 750, motherfucker. That's what I want to know. Mm -hmm. It's certified, Mr. Cuts. We had certified it, and it's a 750 guaranteed to drop 750 CFM. That's a lot of motherfucking gas. I don't care how you add it up. Yeah. But that 930, <laughs> that 930 is another story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but this right here, this right here got Bodice Aluminums on it. It's got a full roller, roller cam. It's, it's full of roller right here. Mm -hmm. The difference between a Fold and a Chevrolet, vibration-wise, mm -hmm. a Fold a lot smoother. See this? You know this ain't got that, that girdle on the top of these right here? Yeah. You can lock these poly locks down on this right here. Mm -hmm. And you can take this motherfucker right here. You ain't even got to go 75. You can go 6,500 in this motherfucker right here, and it's going to be making some real power for your ass. But the bottom end is a different story from the from the bottom end on the Chevy. The top end on the Chevy is a different story from the top end of the fold. The bottom end on the fold, now you, I got it girdled. Mm -hmm. Like the shit right there. Yeah. It's girdled, and it's got a girdle on the fucking main caps everything to keep that motherfucker from doing this. Because mm -hmm. the Ford, the, the, the crankshaft on the Ford is like a baby on a cradle. It want to rock. Mm -hmm. Rock your baby. Come on and rock your baby. And sometimes that motherfucker rock too much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> when you get up into the RP of big money. Yeah. You remember how you used to run that bill and get that motherfucking dust and die your shit, that Chevrolet? Yeah, you caused me an accident and messing with you. And I that motherfucker, mm -hmm. and it sound like a tuning fork. Mm -hmm. Well, this bitch right here, sometimes he get to moving like this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the tuning fork break. <laughs> <laughs> and you got motherfucking rods and pistons and crankshaft on the street. I still love doing this shit, man. In a nutshell, what I'm saying is... It ain't how much motherfucking money you spend. It ain't. If you go to motherfucking Chip Foosh, mm -hmm. if you go to Chip Foosh and spend a hundred and seventy-five fucking thousand dollars for a car and bring that motherfucker out here, and a nigga like. <laughs> No Limit Motorsports, myself. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I think that name sounds a little better. No Limit Motorsports, because me and my little brother, mm. me and my little brother, Adi, man, I don't know where I'd be if it were for him. Mm. I'd still be in Georgia, man. Right now, I'd still be in Georgia. Barbecuing. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Cause I be at the barbecue pit with my mama. Mm. I probably be the same fuck cars. <laughs> they be working on fucking tractors and shit. <laughs> you come down to Georgia, nigga be pulling a goddamn plow across the motherfucking tractor, but with a tractor with a goddamn him in it. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> but you can spend like this car right here. Okay, this is a 70 split bumper, right? Yeah. This is a real 70 split bumper, Z28. You can take this motherfuckers to Camaro Unlimited. Note the key word in the sentence, Camaro Unlimited. Time you roll this bitch in the door, they're going to be like, oh, fuck, that's going to cost you at least 70000 for us to bring it back, buddy. Right? Them motherfuckers sitting right here. I know a motherfucker that do the same show paint that they gonna do for 30 grand for five. And last longer. And you can drive the motherfucker and you ain't gotta worry about whole oh, shit, man. I gotta put my shit in a closed car trailer cause I don't want it to get chipped. Oh man, what? Hey man, your son touching your car. What? Boy, if you don't get your ass out of my car, you know how much I pay for that paint job? Your children can't even enjoy your shit. 
Mm-hmm. Fix some shit so you, your kids, your wife will appreciate, can get in and ride. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I've been knowing you a long time, boy. I'm going to do some shit for you because I know you. I remember when you first started. Shit. <laughs> I remember you when you first fucking started. Motherfuckers might not know, but I know. <laughs> From police scanners to boom boxes to fixing motorcycles. <laughs> Shit. I've been doing you a long time. What I'm saying in a nutshell, money, I'm still that same nigga that love and enjoy doing this. I see a bigger picture than money. Mm-hmm.